Tucked inside Central United Methodist Church is a cozy studio that welcomes homeless men and women to step inside and express themselves artistically. Because people wouldn't necessarily think the first thing that a homeless person would want to do is to sit down and paint something. What we like to do at Art and Soul is we like to create a family atmosphere. We like for people to feel like it's home. A home where art feeds the soul. Run by Ann Windley, Art and Soul is providing dignity and a sense of purpose to people who are homeless. People like Tiana Odom, once destitute, but now flourishing. We try to be a family down in Art and Soul. Once you come in, I think you'll hear laughter. There's a lot of bright colors around. People are doing their own thing. Maybe a, a crayon or some pencil sitting by them and they start a doodle project and the next thing you know, we're framing it and hanging it somewhere. Art and Soul has exhibited at multiple venues, including Henry Ford Hospital and festivals like Art Prize in Grand Rapids. Artists also sell their work throughout Detroit, giving each artist a sense of fulfillment. What is it about art or creativity that is soothing, educational, healing, I guess, in some way? We all have artistic abilities, but to follow through and complete a project is what's important. Mm -hmm. And we feel good that we have made the day better for, for our participants, and that's what we love to do. Bringing art into the hands of the homeless, Art and Soul is painting with a purpose right here in the heart of Detroit.